At the front table of the machine, the start position consists of pop-up stops at each conveyor position. The running sequence starts either automatically by sensor or manually by start buttons located at each end of the working table. A two-way switch at the control panel switches the start sequence from manual to automatic. A back position alignment actuator drops down to position the panel in the machine. To position the panel at the opposite end, the router with a positioning actuator on board moves into position. This actuator also incorporates a side pusher to push the panel against the fence. This sequence also works in mirror image for opposite handed parts. Two side fences for hole setback at the bottom or top of the workpiece have three positions and are controlled by a switch at the front panel. The router carriage and router both travel by rack and pinion on star bearings and dual guideways. Router movement and RPMs are controlled by two rheostats at the front panel. Setup for through boring and one side boring is set by two switches at the control panel. The workpiece can be returned to the operator or fed through to the back of the machine. There are three dust collection extraction points with chutes to collect the chips as they fall away from the drilling line. Dust and chips are also collected at the router. The computer utilizes the Windows 2000 operating system. The computer has many capabilities including metric and American measurements, choice of different languages, parametric programming, and automatic mirror imaging. The industrial computer with 15-inch VGA monitor can be programmed for barcoding and can include networking capabilities for CAD-CAM connections. 